Hey everyone, RJ here. Welcome back to the channel. And today I'll be doing an unboxing, taking a first look at the TCL 10L. Let's get it started. Okay, so first things first, I wanna give a special thanks to TCL for sending this phone out to unbox and review for y'all. I know this phone's been out for a little bit now and there's a lot of reviews about it, a lot of unboxings on this phone already, but I'm thankful to be able to actually bring it to y'all myself and just give you my thoughts on the phone. Now here, of course, is the box with the phone on the side here. 6.53 inch full HD plus display. You got a 48 megapixel camera. It's a four camera setup, a 16 megapixel front facing camera. You got some kind of super Bluetooth um, on this phone as well with a 4,000 milliamp battery. Let's go ahead and take the top off. All right, right up top here, we have your SIM ejection tool along with this little box here, which I'm guessing got your instruction manual and your case. And that's what it looks like here. So in here, well, something, stuck, there we go. Got your safety and precautions manual there. Uh, yep, right there, <laughs> along with your clear case, which is always nice that they put into the box. Got the phone here. We'll put it out to the side for a moment. And in here, of course, you do get your USB Type-C charging cable right there. Really nice stuff. We'll just leave that here in the box. And of course, you get your TCL branded wall adapter right here. And I think it has some kind of fast charging. I'm not sure. You know, it's five volts at two amps. So not really sure. Um, how much or how fast this phone will charge. We'll figure all that out. But anyway, let's put all this away and we'll look at the phone. Okay, so the device is in hand. And I gotta say, it's, this phone looks really nice. Got that really nice little shimmer to it there, as you can see. Really nice look. On the back there, of course, is your four cameras, dual flash, your fingerprint scanner, TCO Brandon on the right side here, power button, as well as your volume rocker on top, your 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and your secondary mic. On the left is your SIM ejection um, slot right here, your multi-function key there. On the bottom is your microphone type C charging port and bottom firing speaker. And on the front here, you got your really nice 6.53 inch display and your corner camera notch over here, a little hole punch. Let's go ahead and power this phone on. All right, got TCL powered by Android. So yeah, really excited to unbox this phone. I'll go ahead and get it all set up and I'll come back when it's finished. Okay, so we're all set up now and ready to go. Let's go ahead and check out that fingerprint scanner now. And pretty quick, try it again. Yeah, not bad at all. Also got face unlock set up. Let's try that out now. Man, that's pretty quick. Yeah, not bad at all. Now, pull the drop down here. See the auto brightness on or off. Turn the screen up a little bit here. It, my phone kind of washes it out a little bit for some reason or another. Um, but yeah, anyway, the display, full HD, 1080, looks really nice. Has that next vision display. The pictures look really nice, really clear. Even though this is not an AMOLED display like the TCL 10 Pro, the display still looks really nice and vibrant. Uh, pull up here, got your app drawer, TCL's UI, uh, has their own you know, take on it. Communications, media, everything is in its own little place. Utilities, uh, system, travel. So pretty nice stuff there. Phone feels really nice. Got your Google stuff over here as well. Yeah. <laughs> and uh so yeah so far the phone is looking and feeling really nice the display a little hole punch over there for the camera you know no no notch no nothing pretty much a full display here so uh, so far right out of the box i am loving this device this phone goes for 249.99 amazing deal for what you're getting this phone runs the snapdragon 665 processor with six gigabytes of RAM and 64 gigabytes of internal storage. And it is expandable with a SD card. Now we'll drop down from the top here. You've got all your settings, your cellular data, Bluetooth, iComfort mode, don't disturb. This phone does have NFC. 
So yeah, NFC here on board. Screenshot, screen recorder, location, just typical stuff. One-handed mode, dark mode there as well. Wanted to set this here for a moment. Got your network and internet. Got your Bluetooth and device connection. NFC, you can cast your screen, your printing, all that good stuff there as well. Display, got your hole punch display. So yeah, it just turn on the switch for best experience possible. You can read that right there. So yeah, okay. Uh, status bar, you can have a style uh, default or you can actually hide the front camera. So whichever you wanna do, I mean, honestly, that right there is not intrusive at all to me. So I'm gonna leave it like that. Show network speed, battery percentage. I like it next to the battery icon. So we're gonna put it right there. Uh, back out of here, got dark mode. So we're gonna turn that on now because I like dark mode a lot better personally. Eye comfort mode, that's a brightness, sleep, font size, image display, stuff like that. Next vision, you get your visual enhancement by turning it off and on. You can see a bit of a difference there. Uh, reading mode, screen color, sonic display, and all that kind of good stuff there. Home screen and wallpapers, got your home app, which is launcher or simple launcher. You have your wallpapers, themes, home settings, uh, home screen st uh, style. So you can have a home and drawer screen or just a home screen only, whichever you prefer. Fill empty cells, home screen grid. You can do a five by six, four by five, four by six, five by five, or five by six, whatever you prefer there. And it went home. <laughs> Let's go back into the settings here uh, for just a second. And uh, go back down here to home screen. And there we go, home settings. And then of course, lock screen preferences there. Now we got your sound, advanced features here for system navigation, app cloner, screen recorder, got gestures, flip to mute, three finger screenshot, just like that. You also have your split screen gestures. Yeah, all that kind of stuff there. Split screen gesture, quick launch camera and tap to wake, driving mode, game mode, smart key, uh, which yeah, smart key. You can go in here. Let's see, where, where, where was it at? There, where was it at? There it is, smart key. Uh, single press, double press, and long press, and you can choose all your apps, launch camera, take a selfie, take a shot, whatever you want to do. That button can be used for a variety of things, which is really nice there as well. Uh, smart manager. So we'll go in here and look around a little bit. And right now it's scanning, battery, uh, memory. This phone does have six gigabytes of RAM, as you can see right there. Now you have your security, so you have your screen lock, fingerprint sensor, face key, smart lock, private space, apps lock, emergency services, all that kind of nice stuff there. Privacy app storage is 64 gigs, 13 gigs used. You got 50.87 gigabytes free, and you can add an SD card, I do believe as well. Down here at system, you have your about phone, Reset, date and time, system update, and all that kind of stuff there. And here at About Phone, you see the model number, T770B, Snapdragon 665, 48 megapixel, plus 8 megapixel, plus 2 megapixel, plus 2 megapixel, and your 16 megapixel front camera. Resolution is 1080 by 2340, 6 gigabytes of RAM, 64 gigabytes of storage, we're an Android 10 on March 1st, 2020 security patch, and a 4,000 milliamp battery. So, there you go. Uh, just a first look here at the TCL 10L. One thing about the phone so far that I'm really liking is the fact that it's got a flat display. Uh, curved displays like the 10 Pro, a lot of accidental touches and the flat display here, I'm really liking uh, that a little bit better. Um, the screen is a bit bigger, which you really can't tell it. Uh, maybe a little bit because they don't drop off the edge here, but yeah, so far I'm, I'm liking the phone. Nice, 250, and it's unlocked for GSM carriers. I mean, look at the bands here. The bands is on the bottom of the box. So I'll go ahead and read you all the bands to this, uh, for the LTE bands. You got bands 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 8, 12, 13, 17, 26, 28, and 66. Of course, you got 38, 40, and 41 here as well, and band 25, it says. So plenty of bands. Yeah, no no shortage of bands here. Uh, no band 71, which most people don't need that in a way. But anyway, um, let's go to the camera here for just a brief, brief moment. I'll do more with the camera here at a later time. Um, 
But I'll take a quick picture here of the TCL box and we'll just see just how the quality looks. All right, just taking just a quick picture here. And okay, yes, yes, yes. Picture comes out nice, clear. Yeah, picture comes out good. Of course, we're just in a regular room with a regular LED light. You got auto video, you got portrait, super macro mode, over here to more, slow mo, stop motion, light trace, panorama, and high pixel. You can also add more stuff here, like portrait, super macro, and pro mode, and all that kind of nice stuff there. Now, going through the settings here for just a second. Photo size is originally 12 megapixels, 48 megapixel high pixel. Um, video records in 4K at 30, 1080 at 30, 720 at 30, and 480 at 30. And got electronic image stabilization, calorie detection, AI camera, AI composition, just all that really nice stuff there. Now in the video, the settings are probably the exact same here. Yeah, it's all the same. Now the front facing camera, um, whoa, that looks really zoomed in, <laughs> really zoomed in. Um, back out a little bit there and you'll see there is the front camera. So why we'll just do some testing here on the cameras and all like that. I still need to do some testing on the TCL 10 Pro's cameras. Um, but like I may mention, it's just been really, um, messy and rainy and not been able to get really any kind of good photo photos and videos here lately. So, uh, hopefully it'll clear up soon. I can get some, you know, good shots here from these phones. Uh, but this is a TCL 10L and it's a little bit scattered. I do apologize for that, but for 250, I mean, this phone's got really all that you really need in a phone, to be honest. A power, I know a good mid range processor, plenty of RAM, plenty of storage, SD card, four cameras on the rear, uh, face unlock, fingerprint scanner. I mean, it's just your overall, all around good looking device for a price of 250. You can't really beat it. So, for so self informative in any way, hit that like button. Any questions you may have, leave it below. I got back to you as soon as possible. If you haven't subscribed, you please consider doing so. I'd appreciate it. Y'all have a good one, and thanks for watching.